Mm-mm-mm. Can you hear the dog ASMR? He's eating a snack. No! Why did I have to look in there? What the hell is my password? Guys, I think I'm catching a cold. Cause it got suddenly so freaking cold nowadays, like recently. Uh, holding me down? I'm trying to remember what that Sean, what that Sean Mendes song was. Sean. Mendes. There's nothing holding me back. That song. Please have mercy on me. Mm -mm. So I've been singing it all day. I don't know why it's stuck in my stuck in my head. How is it? Hello everybody Why is my chat not freaking working? No way Where's my chat? Why is it not working? I swear I locked in You even asked me for my password Why is it not working? How do you do, Crabster? I'm trying to figure out how to see the chat because I it's not it's not loading. I can see it on the in OBS. Wait, 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 wait. <coughs> Can someone type hello in the chat to see if it's working? Please, 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 please. In the meantime, <laughs> I have my, my guitar. A little bit too loud though. Still too loud. I, <laughs> I'm gonna turn off the PGM. A little bit because I wanna sing that song. <laughs> oh wow, uh, BGM is working now. Bonjour. Thank you, Crabster. How do you do? How are you? Uh, na, 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 na. I just I just wanna sing the pre chorus and the chorus. It's still hard to play bar chords. 
like B minus because my my middle finger when it flexes it hurts and it's weak. Oh, I've been shaking a love it. How is the precursor? Oh, I've been shaking. Oh, I've been. Sh How is this? Oh, I've been shaking a love it when you go crazy. You take all of my inhibitions. Maybe a little bit of. Mm -mm. How is this song? Eh? Eh? Mash up. But this is mercy. Please have mercy on me. Take it easy on my heart, even though you don't mean to hurt me. You keep tearing me apart. Won't you please have mercy, mercy on my heart? Won't you please have mercy, mercy on my heart. But where's the other song? It's a ma it's a mashup, but 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 I want it holding me back. There's nothing holding me back. <laughs> what did I click on? Eh, me 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 me. I've been shaking, I love you. Oh! That's, that's all I wanted to do <laughs> with the guitar because I've been singing this song the whole day and I don't know why I have it in my mind but I, I wanted to sing it okay I'm gonna set the guitar aside Not going down with you, baby. Outside? I already gave you a snack. You ate it too soon. You ate it too soon. I cannot do anything for you. You already ate your snack. What do you want me to do? It's your own fault. 
That's not my fault. I swear, there's this freaking smell in my room. I don't know where it comes from, but it's giving me allergies. <laughs> I wish I could just wear my mask. Yeah, my nose is pretty sensitive. And certain smells give me allergies. So sometimes I go to like a car and stuff. Oh, the BGM. <coughs> I go to a car and stuff. Like a, an Uber. And then uh, I'll start getting allergies all of a sudden because of a strong smell. <laughs> I feel there's this strong smell in my room. <laughs> like a fragrance. Fra fragrance. Fra frag. I don't know. I don't know where it's coming from. Because this is not my usual. My usual room. Uh, what you call it? <laughs> room smeller. <laughs> My room isn't. I don't know, man. Uh, I don't know if it's that or I'm just getting a cold because it's been so cold lately. Okay. Okay, I asked Crabster what he was doing. And he was like, casual stupid amount of spending in like two different gacha games, new pretty character, my luck isn't working, I have more than likely disappointed my father. <laughs> Crabster, no! Don't fall for the gacha gods! The gacha demons. More like that. <laughs> Hello, saddest dude. I call you a sad boy. Hello, sad boy. Hello, Dune. Hello, everybody. Dune's number five perfume. My, 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 um, favorite perfume is actually, um, it's a pretty cheap one. Wait, let me blow up my nose. I'm alright when I'm wearing a mask, but I cannot wear a mask with the tracking because it just won't track for some reason. So, um, my favorite soap is actually my favorite soap. My favorite uh, perfume that I own is pretty cheap. I actually don't own any expensive perfumes. Um, I used to have Ralph Lauren, but they were gifts from my mom, and she stopped stopped giving me them they also stopped producing or bringing the one that i liked the most which was number two so they they only made like they only sell here the pink one which is i think number three and i i don't actually like it too much i like the blue one uh that that smell a little citrusy they don't sell it anymore i would spend money on that but they don't sell it here anymore. My favorite is pretty cheap. It is a... Uh, uh, it is a mum cheat. M-U-M-C-H-Y-T. Mum cheat. Um, uh, soft blue soap. It says... Tasting notes, ivy, black currant, I don't know what's that, lily of the valley, narcissus, amber, and white musk. And I happen to really like lily smell and white musk, so. It smells like soap. Mm -hmm. mm. It smells like clean clothes. I really like it. So when, when I'm dressing up, like, 
comfy. I like to wear that one. And when I'm dressing, dressing up like uh, more fancy, I like I'm more feminine. I have one that is called round round A or round A1, round A round, I don't know. Um, it's a b b b body and hair mist um, scent, dry flower. Why hy hydrangea? How do you call it? Hydrangea? Hy hydrangea. In Spanish, it's hydrangea. That flower, you know. And I, uh, I like the smell of white flowers. I have another one that is from the same brand, from the um, blue soap. It's called... Uh, the the mum cheat one it's it's white lily just that white lily it's a hair and body mist so I can put it on my hair and my body <coughs> those are the scents that I own right now uh, the ones that I have for my clothes and room one is green tea and the other one is orange but I don't use them a lot just use them on my room and closet, pretty much. Okay, what we're doing today, <laughs> um, instead of getting super distracted, um, uh, is uh, doing 3D backgrounds. We're not doing them. These are purchased backgrounds. Um, if you're a webtoon artist, even if you're starting, I really suggest you to save up some money and invest invest in some backgrounds, especially the ones that you know that you're going to always use. But you can also find free ba backgrounds in different places like Agon 3D. They have some free backgrounds that are pretty good. Actually, some of the backgrounds that I purchased... Uh, pretty early on those eventually became free so you can get them for free now even though i spend money on them uh, uh or you can get pretty similar ones like or if you want to invest in something that you're gonna always use for example if your uh if your comic is in a school setting you know that you're always gonna be using the school so you pretty you should pretty much invest in a in a stop biting me what are you doing uh, you little demon uh, go play with your toys why are you biting my hand uh, you little demon uh, oh wow wow oh wow wow oh, you are you oh, you you uh, yeah. Okay, no, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> okay. No play with your toys. Oh, do you want do you want another snack? Snoop? Where's your where's your, that, that where's your snoop? Snoop No it says a snoop 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 He's looking for his toy. Good boy! Yes, good boy! So he has a toy. It's called a Snoop. It's like a little ball that you can open and you can put snacks inside. I'm putting some fish. Fish. It says it's baby salmon, but it doesn't look like salmon. <laughs> wow, wow. Mm -mm. Wow, wow. <coughs> Good boy. Wow, wow. <coughs> Good boy. Wow, wow. <coughs> Good boy. Ruru. Ruru. Ah, woo, woo. 
A woo woo. Oh boy. A woo woo. Woo woo woo. Woo woo. A woo woo woo. Woo woo woo. Oh boy. Come on. <laughs> so cute. I'm gonna blow my nose again. Okay. <clears throat> I was saying <clears throat> today we're going to be doing 3D models. Uh, this is one that I purchased. Is uh, one that includes different things for a performance hall. Uh, um, music rela related stuff. Uh, and I modified this one. So, what we're gonna be actually using... This is a SketchUp. But what we're gonna actually be using is... Abler, which looks like this. But, if you wanna use Abler, I really recommend you to first use uh, SketchUp. If you can. Uh, I don't know if the web version has this, but... Uh, the app version allows you to to separate the layers like this not the layers but like the parts and you have like the little i don't know if you can see but there's like a tag window i don't think you can see it well if you cannot see it if you go to windows tags there's like a little option that shows you colors and then you can name each uh what you call it you can name each part that you want uh, and select a color for it and then um, 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 uh, with the tag tool you then go to the parts of the model um, that that comes from the part that you want and uh, paint it so it's a little bit hard to explain if you cannot see but it's basically I have blue with door and then I have door wall with sort of purplish gray and then I have the floor with brown and I have um, item that you cannot see and then I have left wall with sort of reddish orange I have like lilac, violet, uh, right, right wall, and then south wall that you can barely see is green, and then the stairs are blue. This will help you to uh, organize your model when you go to Abler, and then you can turn off the visibility of uh, toggle off the visibility of each part. So if you wanna, I don't know, uh, you wanna export. A scene that looks like this, and you just can turn off the visibility of the left wall, and then you don't have to be hiding each part every time because it's freaking annoying. Um, so yeah, the key for using apps like Abler is um, organizing your models. Some models come organized, some don't, and are pretty bad. I suggest you do this. Uh, at the beginning, I didn't know about this, so I would struggle a lot. Um, without the tagging, it looks like this. The model looks like this. And then with the tagging, pre-organized, it looks like this. <coughs> okay. Let's hide this one and show you the Abler window. This is Abler. You can import your uh, SketchUp models here. Um, and it allows you to render them in a way that is like a lot prettier than SketchUp, which saves you a little bit of time when you're rendering for uh, your webcomic. You can actually just put it and, I don't know, do pretty much nothing or blur out or something um and you don't have to do the shadows and stuff and it looks a lot prettier i'm waiting for the new version that right now is on alpha testing i don't know if beta or beta or uh um alpha testing um 
but in that one you can reduce the opacity of the shadows but it's not available for mag yet so it's a boomer but it's it is whatever <coughs> Lucari is the best demonic boy. Yeah, he's a little demon. He's the cute little demon. So cute. Uh, uh. So, Abler, SketchUp, uh, there's the web version, but um, you can also get the licensed version, which is a little bit expensive. I do have the subscription version. Um, Yep. And Abler is, or Abler, I don't really know how they call it, but I call it Abler because I don't know. Well, Abler uh, is a free software. You can actually get it for free if you subscribe, not subscribe, if you log in or create an account in uh, Acon 3D, um, where, where is the page that I download models and stuff i forgot to add my 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 code but i have a code if you guys uh want to use it to to register on on icon 3d so you can use abler if you want to um i'm gonna post that later in the description but it, it gives you like a discount for your first purchase uh and it gives me a bit of points but not too much <laughs> it's just a referral code uh not sponsored by the way so what i'm doing right now is a scene where uh two people are walking through here now, did I export this one? I don't remember. Did I? Did I? Did I? Okay, I did export this one. So the next one, page two, uh, is supposed to be a little lower. I hope that the program is not too slow because uh, I have different things open and I'm streaming so it generally isn't this slow it's just that I have too many things open so what we're gonna do first <coughs> is that we're gonna do we're gonna go to layers and we're gonna turn off the right wall like this and this is why we organize our model because if we want to export this scene here, we would have like issues looking through it because, you know, it is uh, covered by the wall. And because we have our model nicely organized, uh, we can just turn that off or like the door if we didn't want the door the door can like disappear and stuff um, 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 um what i also want is change a little bit the focal length because the previous one that i had i wanted it to be um with a higher perspective so because the the perspective was um more angular but right now i want it to be a little bit more like parallel not so deformed uh and to achieve this we actually increase the focal length and then uh, we zoom out like this i don't know if you guys can tell the difference um where did i change the models Ow. this line is a little bit too thin and now it's too thick uh, 
like this. Line detail. Hmm, maybe this one. Yeah, it was the line detail that was. Mm, maybe one point three. Mm, one point eight. No, two is fine. You can adjust the size of the lines depending on your style. Because you know, some people have thicker lines in their styles. Mine are mm, relatively thin, but not too much. Uh, so I like them a little bit thicker. Should I increase this one? Yeah, I'm gonna leave it like that. Um, 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 uh. I think I'm gonna export this in a lower angle. Maybe like this. Closer, like this. I think this is good enough. Maybe lower. No, it was fine. And then we go to export. And you can either do a quick render, which will render everything together. Or you can um, like select these things and then render selected, selected scenes, which is the one scene that I have. I, I didn't create any scenes. Um, this will render everything separately so like shadow line texture and full render will all go in a different image if you want a detailed background i normally suggest this but in this case it's a pretty simple background um so i'm just gonna not do that uh what i wanna do for this one though um probably turn off the shadow on stairs um and turn them on on this one wait no i don't want the stairs Ah, uh, whatever. This where's the, the the part where I can okay. So I don't want the ones in the stairs, but I want the one in the door. Mm mm. Some water. I don't know, man. Is I just export it like this? Maybe if I move the angle, it's one hundred right now. Uh, like this, but I don't want. I don't want the door to cast a shadow. Or maybe I want the door to cast a shadow. Okay, that's better. Oh, no, wait! Uh. No, let's go back. Let's go back. Maybe if I also hide this one... Then, uh, yeah, this is pretty decent. Mm -hmm. I would say it's pretty decent. Um, um, uh, 
Okay, let's let's export it. Like I said, this one, this uh, background is pretty simple. So I'm just gonna quick render. Uh, we're gonna go in bathroom outside and uh, quick render. And then it's rendering. Wonder if it'll take long because oh, it's ready. Because I have so many things open. Hello, armors. Mm. Is textures applied to the surfaces? I always wonder how those awesome anime backgrounds are made. Okay, there's different ways to create anime backgrounds. Uh, there's like better softwares for rendering, but this one is pretty simple and is easy to use. So uh, I, I really suggest it. And it's also free. So, yeah. Like, if you want to get into it, I really suggest this one. Some people do it, like, in Blender, but I don't know how to use Blender. It's, I don't. I don't know. What computers do you use? Do you know the components? Uh, I can check that. I use a M MacBook Pro uh, 16 inches uh, M1 from 2021. Um, I think it's 16 gigabytes of RAM. It works pretty well with 3D models. Like I know my my brothers uh computer is really good for games but it's pretty bad for for uh 3d rendering so i used to do the rendering on his computer when i didn't have this computer yet and it was so slow the the models will move so slow and my computer that is supposed to have worse components than, than his uh, works works better so uh, even though there's a lot of things that I cannot do without Windows, um, at least in Mac, um, I can do work-related stuff, and it works pretty well. Mm -mm. Hello, Chris. I use SketchUp a little for fun. I think for the architects, it is very good. Yeah, it is. But for something more, create a blender is better. Sketch SketchUp has too many rules. Yeah, the thing is that SketchUp is simple. It's something good if you want something simple. Blender is a lot more pro and you you can do a lot more stuff. But it's also a lot of more manual work and uh, a lot more requirements for your PC. And um, it's not as intuitive as abler or abler so i prefer to use abler because i tried to use blender and i didn't understand <laughs> uh, mag m1 is good but i think that in this case it is uh the stream that uses the graphic resources yeah but it's working pretty fine i think in this case it's, it's working just fine I don't know how it will work with like another model, but uh, this this one model is pretty simple, so it's working just fine. A little bit more laggy than usual because I'm streaming, but uh, it still works, which is the important part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and in this case, what I want to do... No, not that baby. That's not what I want to do. Is hide the left wall because it's too dark and I only want the stairs and the... What do you call it? Re railway? The, I don't know. I just want this. You guys can see my mouse, right? Ah, uh, yeah. I want this. So I'm just gonna... Export that. 
and then we're gonna turn on the sh shadows again for this. Yeah, turn off the shadows for that. Oh, they were on. Oh well. Not that it matters. It's a really zoomed in the um, scene. Uh, let's change the name to two. And then quick render. Come on. And now it's rendering. In the meantime, oh, it's ready. In the meantime, not in the meantime because it's it's, it's ready. Um, we turn this back on, and then we're gonna turn off the south wall. South. Oh no! This is the left wall. Uh, south. Okay. I'm gonna change it to like a higher angle. And then we're gonna go to camera and reduce the focal length because I wanna. Is I want more perspective. Um, uh, maybe not too much. I, I just said a few hours ago, why am I hungry again? Why does my stream always make me hungry? Um, 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 and then we go to style because I wanna shift the shadows a little bit like this. Oh, my happy baby! Oh, you're so cute. Who's my cute baby? I love you. I love you. I love this baby so much. Mm -mm. He's no longer a baby, but in my heart, he's always going to be my baby. Ah! What I do? Shit. I blame you. It's your fault. Uh, and I pressed. Press option because I want it to be a little bit more straight. And now that we fixed it, then we go back. No, what do you, what you do? What the heck you do? Why ya? Uh? I think this is fine. Mm -mm. Is it? Is it? Is it fine? Is this fine? Is it fine? Mm. I have my storyboard done, so I'm looking at that. I cannot show you guys. Um, I mean, I just get it right. What, what the hell did I do? What the hell did I do? What did I do? I'm just gonna leave it like this. I think it's I think it's good enough. And I'm just gonna raise a little bit 
angle that is angle like this I wanna rotate it a little bit but I don't know how to do that <laughs> okay that's that's good enough and then we change it to three the name and quick render and now it's rendering in the meantime let's read the chat Railing, that, that thing. Not gonna lie, I sometimes think Lucario's whining are care tires burning rubber on the street. What? No, m m or street is not that noisy. Uh, it's mainly like just dogs and sometimes like big buses uh, or trucks. Trucks, trucks that sound pretty pretty loud I'm chilling right now playing Minecraft Pokemon what the hell is Minecraft Pokemon okay okay so we have a little bit of an issue in the next scene because um Remember the question that I did on Twitter asking who was uh, 180 centimeters or higher that, that could tell me if a 160 cent 163 centimeters girl would be able to reach the cheeks with her hands? Okay, the conclusion of that question was yes. But now the scene is in the stairs. So I don't know. We're gonna figure out. So when I thought about the scene, I actually didn't think about the stairs. But then when I checked the models that I had, I only have this one that can work for that scene. Yeah, we, we're gonna figure it out. Eventually. Um, can I make this one not get affected by shading? Okay, this is a little bit dark. Um, I think like this is pretty good for that scene. Maybe a little bit higher, like this. <laughs> and then we export. Number four. I'm hungry. I have, I have some choco left. From Easter. Not giving you. Dogs cannot eat choco. No, no, no. Choco is bad for doggies. Mm -mm. It's not for you. You're already able. You're already able. Freaking really husky. Depending on what stairs, I could probably guess if she could reach. I walk with a short friend around a lot, so I could probably estimate. You can see the stairs on the screen, right? Can you see them on the screen? So, she would be like here. And he would be like here or here. Probably here. No, that would be too close. Maybe here. But like turning around. And she reaches... Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's what happens. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can what? Reach? I mean, I guess... I guess we... It would be like able to reach if um if you sort of like jump and or go to your tippy toes and then reach for the face and make the guy bend down I think So what is happening is that the dude is going up and then the girl stops him and then he turns around and then if she goes to her tippy toes maybe she can reach the face and make the guy bend down do you think that that could happen? <laughs> hello Matsuyun how are you? Mm -mm. yes no more choco baby no more choco. I ate it all. It was my Easter's choco. It wasn't even mine. They gave it to my brother. Nobody gives me anything. They, they gave it. Here. Nobody here gives me anything. Because uh, I have friends that give me things. <laughs> uh... And they gave it to him, but he doesn't really eat choco. So he was like, I, I asked him, like, is that it for me? And he was like, do you want it? I was like, ain't you gonna eat it? And he was like, you know, I don't need those things. So I was like, yay, for me. Mm. If she's on her tippy toes and he's bending down, yeah, I think that would work. I mean, he's not bending down at first. And she makes him. Right? There's no more Choco, baby! You can stop harassing me! <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> okay. Um, do I want to export? Do I want a background on that scene? I'm just gonna export one in case, but I'm not sure if it's going to have a background like this. I feel like it probably won't. Hey, what are you doing with my chair? And please don't. Don't drag my cables again. The other day, uh, I was I was in a call with a friend, uh, and Lucario just went to his usual spot that he likes to sleep in, and he, I don't know what he did, but he dragged the the cables from the extender. Is it extensor or extender? Pretty sure I've been told like twice already how it's called and I don't remember. Uh, wait, what is this? Can I sneeze? <coughs> Man. I don't understand. I was pretty well the whole day. And then suddenly, when I go to stream on my room, suddenly allergies for no reason. And it's that, that weird smell that I'm telling you. It's not a bad smell, but it's just smell that I'm not used to. And apparently my body is like, nope. Nope. It's like, nope. Uh, I turn off the door wall and turn on the south wall. And 
and then I wanna high up. We're gonna turn off the items too. I wanna sort of high up. Uh, <laughs> that sounds like high ya. <laughs> I'm not trying to say high ya. I'm not trying to say high up. Why is it dark? It's not casting a shadow. Why is it dark? Oh. Oh, I guess. Uh, like this. Do we have ceiling? I don't think we have ceiling. No, we don't have a ceiling. Mm, I wonder if it'll look better if I move. Uh, Attitude and stuff. How about the Asimut? Mm, why is it only applying to some stairs and not the others? <laughs> is it too shiny? <laughs> is this too shiny? I don't want to apply, apply the shading to the wall. This is too dark. It's the same. Oh. Hey, this is pretty good. I can make this one work, I think. And um, reduce the focal length. And then zoom in a little bit. And... Uh, yep, I think this one is good enough. And then we go to export, render viewport, we change it. Number numero cinco. Number five. Uh, quick render. And rendering. In the meantime, we rechat. Uh, oh my god. Wait, my friend tried this on me. Really? We ended up falling off the stairs? Gosh. That sounds pretty romantic to me. <laughs> Since you talk more, air is also circulated through our nose. Maybe that's why. Mm, it's not that. It started before a stream. It started right when I was setting up. So I don't know. I don't know why. Looks like evening. It doesn't even have a sky. And then this one is from the other side. So because this is from the other side, we are going to turn back on the visibility of the door wall. Then we're going to turn off the one of the saw wall. And then I think I need the right wall. Um, and then let me center. Which is by pressing A plus uh dot a um, dot uh and then i'm gonna need a little bit less focal length it's pretty angular scene i think like this is pretty good but i uh Like this. I need uh, shading uh, since we modified it. Uh, 
and then the Asimus. This is looks pretty good, I would say. Can I make it a little bit more straight, straighter? Mm, I'm gonna export two versions. Export this version over here, which is a little bit more high up. And this is going to be numero seis, number six, V1. <coughs> Quick render. And then I want to export one that is a little bit lower because uh, I want to have just another version in case it's too high. Like this. Just in case so that I don't have to go back to the file version 2. Uh, and then we go, go to the next page. Me, 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 me. Page. Okay. Uh, I think we can reduce, re, 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 reuse a background for this one. No, let's just explore another one just in case. Like this. Sh sh just in case. You never know. Better to have one than to have to go back. And if we don't need it, we don't need it. Quick render. Shadows looks like evening. Well, I it's really hard to modify the the opacity of the shadows. So right now I'm just leaving it like that, and then I'll modify it uh, on the drawing software. But in a future update of the software, uh, one of the features that I'm looking forward to is. Uh, the changing of the opacity of the of the shadows because right now you have to modify the entire thing and it's really it's, it's really hard <laughs> where's my mouse mm. now my friend was trying to steal a piece of candy and I had it in my mouth that I stole from them that sounds like a romantic scene! <laughs> I swear, one time I was with this dude back in high school. Um, and I liked the dude. And I'm pretty sure I gave him eno enough hints that I liked him. And it seems, seemed that he liked me too. Uh, and we made plans to study together and uh, watch a movie at his house. So we were watching the movie. Uh, it was a movie that he chose. One of his favorites. Uh, what was the name? Uh, Into the Woods or something like that. I don't remember. Let me, let me really Google it. Into the Woods. Was it? Okay, it's not this one. Freaking James Gordon. No, it was... Uh, it was a movie about a dude that goes to the woods. Like, he doesn't like his life and he ends up going to the woods. 
Uh, what's the name? What's the name? Uh, movie. Um. What about movie guy goes to the woods? There's a movie that is called Boys in the Woods. <laughs> No! No! <clears throat> Lost in the woods, the man in the woods, the wood, the woodsman. I don't know, man. I don't even remember the actor. Forget it. In the wood? No, that's a horror. No, it wasn't horror. It wasn't. It was a room. It was a good movie, though. I don't remember much because I was pretty nervous. <laughs> but from what I remember, it was a good movie. <laughs> and we were, uh, we were sitting on his bed, and the lights were off. And we were watching the movie, and then, uh, what was it? I think I took his hat or something like that, and he was like, but it wouldn't make sense that I take his hat, because why would he have a hat inside the house? Like, inside his room, why would he be wearing a hat? But I had something, something from him. I took it. And he was like, give it back. And I was like, nah. -uh. And he was like, give it back. And I was like, nah. -uh. And then uh, he reached to take the hat. Um, and then fell on top of me. <sighs> Wait, I need to charge my phone. Like, you know, the classics, the classic scene. Where the guy is, uh, or the girl is trying to reach uh, something from the other person, and then he grabs it or she grabs it, and then one person falls on top of the other one and is like uh, close to the leaves with each other. And it's like romantic and stuff. So we kissed and stuff. And then, and then, and then. And then he told me to never tell, never tell anybody that this happened, and definitely not our friends. So yeah, he broke my heart. <laughs> this mother freaking idiot. And that's what happened. <clears throat> that's just a scene from a romantic comic. No, that's my life. That did happen. And then he told me to never tell anybody. And then I, 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 I called my friend. I was like, this happened with this dude. And uh, I don't know why, but I, I he told me to not tell anybody. And I'm like, did I suck so much that you, you, you don't want anybody finding out? I don't know. Bro got embarrassed. I don't know, man. I don't know if he, he was embarrassed. He just... So, our relationship was a little bit complicated because uh, he was heartbroken. He was my friend's ex. Another friend. And the problem is that I hope he never watches this or anybody I know. <laughs> Uh, the problem is that he liked this girl for a very long time and things didn't work out. So I was like consoling him and giving him advice and hearing him out. And then I catched feelings uh, for this dude. 
and he was so curious about who I liked. And he's like, if you're not interested in me, why the fuck are you curious about who I like? So I thought it was sort of like a green light. And then things happened and he regretted it. So I guess he didn't want our friends to find out because one of them is his ex. Which is also my friend. But the problem is that they were sort of childhood friends. And he liked her for years and years and years. He, the dude was like really romantic. Like he would ser serenade the girl in the middle of the class. And you know how it goes that you you like how the guy is with another girl and then you fall in love and then you realize that it doesn't mean that he's going to be that way with you. Anyways, they dated for a while and nobody could tell they were dating because they just acted like friends. And then she, I think she realized that it didn't make a difference that they were dating so they broke up because she I don't know but they were still friends anyways it was pretty hurtful I think if my heart wouldn't have been broken by that dude at that time I would have probably not dated my ex later because I fell pretty fast for him. And if I didn't have dated my ex, I wouldn't have gotten the huge amount of trauma that I have even now. <laughs> oh, dude. I hate my life. Mm -mm. I made that into a webcomic, The Plot. <sighs> Maybe one day. It's pretty basic plot, though. Mm. Mm. I don't... Do I need a background for the next one? Do I? No, I don't think so. And then uh, I need one uh, from the... this side so I'm gonna turn off the right wall and then it's like a pretty low angle I think like this I think this is good enough. Can you guys hear that? The police. FBI, open up! Mm. I'm just... I'm innocent. I'm just a trafficker of kisses for my, my doggo. I swear. Mm -mm. Your life sounds like a romantic novel. My life is more like a tragic realism film with LTR. No way! Well, one of my stories has a little bit of NTR, but I was the other girl. <laughs> I was really stupid and immature and I still regret it, but uh, it's not like the dude wouldn't have cheated if it wasn't because of me, because he has been cheating for years and I was just really impulsive and I was like, I'm going to China anyways. So stuff happened. Um, but like I said, I, I did it knowing that this dude is a huge cheater. And I was like, I'm not dating you, dude. He's like, but, 
but I don't want you to date other guys. And I was like, dude, you have a fucking girlfriend. And you are telling me to not date other guys? I was not gonna. I was traveling to China, but I was like, I'm not going to be exclusive to you, you piece of shit. Mm. Anyways, that dude speak to, spoke. This dude is funny because he... Should I say this? I probably shouldn't say this. It's funny because he pretended to be such like a... Playboy, like a womanizer that got all, all the girls and stuff. And he would be on freaking Tinder when he was still dating his longtime girlfriend. And everybody knew. And he was like pretending to be such huge game, but... His pee-pee was small. It was pretty small. It was really disappointing. I'm sorry. <laughs> mm. Because it happened to you, you will be able to depict it much better. <laughs> I want to... Uh, write... Something that happened to me once. So, when I was like 14, it was like a soulmate's encounter. Like when, when you meet someone and you don't know why, but they attract you so much. And it's like, wow, this guy is so different from the others. And he was like at the library and stuff. And so old fashioned. And I still remember that day. But I, I don't know the guy. I, I don't think I ever meet him, but I would love to write a story and for it to have like a happy ending. <laughs> My Lulu self wants it. <laughs> Crabster, you do not want to know. Yeah, Crabster, don't, don't, don't look for it. Don't. You're too young to know what NTR is. My Peru! They're coming for you. Who? Oh, the FBI. I'm just a trafficker of dog kisses. I'm innocent, I swear. It's bad, it's pretty bad. Isn't it? I mean, NTR is just cheating, so. It's the sort of plot about cheating. Any tips for making your webtoon attractive in terms of story plot? Like how to hook a person in the first episode? Do you have tips for, from your personal experience? So there's different ways to make your story um, interesting to people from the first episode. First is the art. The art is the first thing that people will look at. So um, of course, it's not always important because a lot of famous stories came from pretty shitty uh, webtoon art. Like like One Punch Man uh, or Horimiya. The original webtoon, the art was pretty basic or shitty. So <laughs> the art is not like the most important. But uh, it can be something that m makes people want to stay. Like they look at it, and it's like, wow, the art is so gorgeous. Um, so yeah, art can be one, but art alone is not enough. Um, another thing is um, a sort of plot that will make people wonder what will happen next or why something is happening. So. Um, from what my quote-unquote comic teacher taught ta me, he's not actually my teacher. I I've told this story a lot of times, but he's a dude that used to teach how to draw on TV on, on here in Chile. And he, uh, he did some courses, cor cor courses. Not curses, courses. I always do this. Courses, not curses, courses. He, he did a course in my city. 
uh, I think like two years in a row. Um, and he talked like the the techniques that he learned from some Japanese manga creators. One of them was that an interesting story doesn't start from the very beginning or from the very end. It starts from the middle. So you can explain what happened in the past and what's going to happen and, and make people want to know what happens in the future. Uh, I think those sort of stories are pretty interesting. Um, but if you don't have that, you can also make like a sequential story. Um, for example, isekais normally are this way where the protagonist starts in their normal life and then they suddenly died uh, by, I don't know, being hit by truck or something. And then... Um, and then uh, they start their new life as someone else. That's a plot device that works pretty good. Um, but in those cases, I think it's very important to make your characters interesting. Like your plot doesn't have to be very unique. It can be filled with um, cliches and stuff. But as long as your characters are interesting to people, then it will also hook them up. Um, and lastly, like a question, a question that you want your readers to ask themselves um, that is like simple to, to imagine people asking. For example, for me, it was like, what the hell happened to Nina? <laughs> like, why is it... Um, what was the first episode like? I forgot... She was in a she was in a dream world, like everything was full of darkness, and then she wakes up in the in the hospital with a lot of uh, uh, strange people, and she didn't have any memories, and then it keeps you wondering what happened to Nina. So an easy question to ask that people want to know the answer for. Yep. Judge, if being pretty is a crime, I plead guilty. Judge, you are here for tax evasion. <laughs> Wait, how do you know that? How else do you know that a man's pee-pee is small? Mm -mm. <laughs> Just ask yourself that and you'll know the answer. I think it became a bit more than just cheating, even though it means exactly that. NTR is holding hands with another girl when your girlfriend had only gave you a poke on Facebook. <laughs> what are you talking about, my <laughs> What? But like, there's like different sort of NTR, but the, the most basic... Explanation for Netorare is just cheating. Um, yeah. Not that I could ever get cheated on. I've never been in a relationship, but I have been stood up on a fre friend date because they were going to meet a girl instead. But that's not freaking Netorare! That's not NTR! That's just you being jealous of your friend! It's a very cheaty friend for doing that, but it's not Netorare, I think. It's not. NTR would be like... Like, I don't know... Um... The... 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 the, the let's... Let's create a... NTR plot that is safe for work. So, um, the guy that she has liked for four years, um, she finally decides to confess to him. And then she, she confesses and he says he likes her. And then uh, he doesn't ask her out. And then the next day, she 
goes to the balcony, the, the rooftop of the school, and he finds out that this dude is kissing her best friend. And that's NTR. So you don't have to be dating, but it's like that sort of betrayal. There's a guy told her that he liked her and then he goes and kisses uh, someone else and he happens to be her best friend. Any resemblance with reality is uh, not true. This is fiction. No, <laughs> I'm telling the truth. This is, I just made it up. <laughs> Watching something from a closet. Y y yeah, that's, uh, that's used really often too. Like the husband goes to the closet and then he finds out that his wife is with someone else. And I'm not gonna say what they're doing. So Netorare is cheating with extra steps. No, it's just cheating. It could be like emotionally cheating or it could be actual cheating or they, they 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 don't even have to be dating but if they betray your feelings I think it would be also considered as netorare. Oh this is, there's a pretty good netorare uh, webtoon from Lechin uh which is about a girl that um meets this guy and then they they do stuff together they do snoo snoo snooze um and she finds out that they have a lot of chemistry and stuff and then she gets pregnant and then this dude meets her best friend and her best friend looks like i think his ex i don't remember if ex or what it was but because it looks like his ex, then he falls in love with the best friend. And then the best friend betrays her friend with him. And they were not dating. But they, like, the the main girl was, they, uh, was slept with this guy. But they weren't dating. And then she finds out she's pregnant. But this dude is sleeping with her best friend. It's like, oh my god. The pain... The pain. I think it would be better if her friend didn't want to kiss her new uh, boyfriend at first. But he was pushy and aggressive and convinced her. I don't know. You can just invent whatever you want in the plot. I just made something up. <laughs> Out of thin air. Honestly, I want to drink the pain away right now. But I don't have any alcohol. Don't drink the pain away, dude. Play a game! <laughs> I... Uh, I learned in a very bad way that I'm not the type of person that can drink the pain away. Because uh, I repress my feelings a lot. And because of that, when I drink, I don't have that filter anymore so i just start crying a lot uh and it's pretty bad and i feel very depressed so it doesn't feel better like if, if it numbs it out a little bit at first and then you keep going and then you feel depressed i hate your life and it's like why did i do this to myself so i just drink uh small quantities i'm i'm not getting drunk ever again because i, I, I uh, the last time that i got pretty drunk it was really bad it's pretty bad <laughs> it was uh, a long time ago it was like 2017 i was i was already sad and then we had a party with my band when I still had the band. Uh, it was a, a band re reunion. Um, and then I was feeling really shitty about my life. I ended up drinking way too much. And then my best friend had to carry me home. 
and the drive wasn't very nice because the movement made me nauseous and then when we arrived outside of my house I was like can, can we sit a little bit I, I'm feeling really sick he was like okay then we sit in the, in the grass outside of my house and then I threw up outside of my house and it was so embarrassing I started crying I was like I hate my life I hate myself I don't want <laughs> Pretty good learning experience to n not do that again. It didn't feel good at all. <laughs> so, yeah, what, what were we doing? <laughs> Doesn't work that well for me either, but sometimes uh, I do it from time to time when I feel too bad. It's uh, it's better to do something else. Do something else. Play a game. Uh, just go to sleep. But I would suggest to play a game. <laughs> Why would you hate yourself? You're awesome. Well, is that that's easy to say from the outside, but. I mean, if your parents been blaming you for everything that happens in their life uh, since forever, then and then your mom blames uh, you for their divorce, and then they tell you all your life that you're ugly and you're and you're useless uh, and you're the reason why. Uh, she has to work so much and her health is bad and all that shit. Then you start thinking that it's true. And then when you start thinking that it's true, you start hating yourself. It's like, why can't I be good for once, for someone, instead of being useless and stuff like that. But I went through therapy and stuff. Uh, so I'm I'm fine now. My therapist told me that that was not true, and she told me that the thoughts that I had in my mind were because uh, it was my mom's voice and not mine, and that a child shouldn't be blamed for things that they didn't choose and stuff. So. But it's a, it's a constant work. It's a, like something that you have to work on the rest of your life. Remind yourself that not to treat yourself so badly, that not everything is your fault. <coughs> and love yourself and treat yourself kindly. It's something that you have to do constantly all your life. Of course, not in excess because... If you're excessive with that, you could turn into a narcissist. So that that isn't good either. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. <coughs> I love uh, um, uh, air gray tea. So yummy. Okay, next scene. Yay therapy. Actually, yay therapy, but you gotta... You gotta find a good therapist. Mm. Because I've had pretty bad experiences with therapists in the past. And they made me feel worse. So you gotta find a good one. Unfortunately, the way I managed to overcome those things was violence. No, no violence. Uh, violence is not the solution. Uh, except if you go to a room that is like made for that and you can destroy things that are designed to be destroyed. I know that for a lot of guys, uh, violence is like the outlet for their emotions. But I would say, you gotta try to find uh, a more healthy outlet. <laughs> mm. 
You should love yourself now. <laughs> I try. I try. Even if I uh, have my moments of weakness, uh, I have people in my life nowadays that remind me constantly that I should love myself and treat myself well uh, and treat me well. So. I don't, I don't know what I did to deserve that sort of people in my life But I'm really happy <laughs> One day, one day you'll find people that Will love you by who you are That will treat you well And will make you realize that maybe What the bad people in your life have told you Is not true mm. It's amazing how people can feel the same with different cir cir circumstances. My parents showed their love. I grew up feeling that being the youngest, my opinion didn't matter. Oh. Yeah, sometimes it's like n internalizing your feelings and not expressing them well. And then you end up with that in your heart uh, for so long that you don't even know why you feel the way that you do and that's why therapy is important because a lot of times you uh, forget why you feel that way about yourself and then therapy can help you figure out why what is the root of of those feelings mm. a lot of times it's like not your parents but like people in school that make you feel unwanted for me, it was a lot of things. <laughs> Not just my parents, but... No violence, only violence! Exactly. Get a violin and learn it. And then when you're mad, play it. With all your emotions. For me... My outlet of emotions is not actually art because when I'm too emotional, I, I cannot draw. For me, my outlet of uh, emotions is actually my guitar. So I just sing and play music, songs. And it actually helps a lot. I got lucky with my therapist, so I'm chilling. That's good. That's really good. I had to go through three therapists until I found a good one now I have accepted the bad side of me as part of me my good and bad sides make me whole that's the thing that's called shadow work because everybody has a good side and a bad side but you have to accept that the bad side exists and the bad thoughts exist within you and then you have to learn how to deal with them and not just shun them away. You have to be able to accept it. And not let it become yourself. And work to be a better person. Like not because you have bad thoughts. It means you're a bad person. It means that you're conscious of it. And then you can give your like do your best to become a better person. And sometimes your purpose in life can just be be a better person. Be the kindest person that you know. Or something like that. Mm. Uh, next scene is going up the stairs. Huh. Huh. Maybe if I could... Copy. Hmm. What can I do? That one, the ceiling. Staring at the ceiling with you. You don't ever say too much. <laughs> That's a Taylor Swift song. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. 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 I can uh, <laughs> there yeah it will be door wall and the door too and then we go to the other side 
Staring on the sand with you You don't ever say too much La 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 into La 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 Da 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 All this shit is new to me I feel the lavender haze keep on creeping me Not real Do 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 What people say Oh my god guys The new Taylor Swift album is coming out next week Yes It's Jover for Joe Alwyn Literally Jover Mm. I feel like he's actually not too high up. Mm. 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 I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Hungry. This is what happens when you eat soup for lunch. I get hungry too fast. Tea. Mm. On Saturday is a Nijizani Ian AR Live. I'm so freaking excited. Why is April so exciting? I swear. I think this is good enough. Yeah, I think this is good. I mean... Uh, I mean... Uh, maybe I should decrease the focal length. Mm. Twenty-eight Twenty-two Like with twenty-two Hoo-hoo Oh, feels like a lot is nice da 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 pa pa da pa pa I don't know about you But I'm feeling twenty-two Everything will be alright if you keep me next to you. I don't know about me. I got this feeling too. La 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 la. Twenty two. Ooh Twenty two. Ooh It's funny that I uh. When I turned 22, I couldn't celebrate it with the song because I was fucking depressed. It's already too late when I was in I wasn't 22 anymore. Quick render. And just read the chat. <coughs> Accept the bad side of your of your to awaken your persona actually no because your persona is already the mask that you put on and the person that you present yourself as but if you do shadow work you can integrate it to your persona Karjang. so the theory from Carl Jung is that you you have you have your inner child, you have your shadow, you have your ego, and then you have your persona. And the persona is uh, the person, the mask that you present yourself as. Like, I don't know, my work persona, my streaming persona, my, I don't know, family persona. Um, which could be 
something totally different from who you are or it could be someone pretty close to who you are and then you have your inner child which is uh, the part of you who is uh, still the child uh, from your childhood um, which a lot of times it's what's wounded in your mind and you have to work through healing and forgiving your inner, inner child like one of like really good exercises that you can do if you were hurt as a child is to go back and imagine your younger self uh, and you approaching them and then telling them that it wasn't their fault and that everything is going to be all right and then telling them what you had wished that someone would have told you when you were younger um, and then you have your ego which is, um, hmm, how do I explain ego? How do I explain ego? Ego, ego, ego. What is it? A person's sense of self-esteem or self-importance. What about Carl Young? The center of the field of consciousness which contains or conscious awareness of, of existing and counting sense of personal identity. What? Oh, can you guys hear my stomach is growling? Ah, I'm so hungry! The center of the field of consciousness which con con contains or conscious awareness of existing and a continuing sense of, self of personal identity. It is the organizer of our thoughts, in twitch, in intuition, feelings and sensations and has access to memories which are not repressed. I don't know how to explain it, but well, the shadow is the part that we repress, that is like our bad side, it's like uh, our negative thoughts, it's uh, uh, the, the thing inside us that put us down or the bad version of ourselves, like what if I was just lazy and didn't do anything today or what if I, uh, uh, I don't know, hurt this person because he hurt me. Uh, something like that um, and to be able to grow grow yourself you have to admit that the shadow exists um, and accept that the bad thoughts exist within you and then you have to uh, learn to live with it and not repress it because a lot of times a lot of times when we repress it is when then the shadow comes out uh, in explosive waves when we cannot control it. So, for example, violence is part of lack of shadow work because uh, you can have the thought in your mind that you want to hurt something, yourself or someone, um, and then you just repress it, like, no, this is not me. And then when it happens and you cannot control it, then you hurt something or yourself or someone, uh, and it's already too late. So if you do that, that shadow work and accept that a part of you actually wants to hurt other people or you or something, um, then you can work in accepting uh, that it exists, learning why uh, and learning how to control it in a healthy way, how to give healthy outlets for your shadow to coexist with you. Um, like the BTS song would say, that the higher you go, the bigger your shadow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you have to learn to, you know, control it and stuff. Karaoke stream for the album release? What do you mean? I do want to do a karaoke stream since I cannot play the guitar still. It still hurts. So my, my, my uh, limit is like two songs. My limit is like two songs, so I cannot play the guitar. 
So I was thinking in doing like a karaoke stream, but I don't know when still because I'm I'm busy. I have weekend plans. Uh, like this weekend, I have plans the next weekend. I have plans the weekend after that. Uh, so it cannot be on a weekend, but maybe on a Friday. But I don't know if this Friday, because this Friday... The next day is AR Live, and I don't want my voice to be dead for AR Live. But I don't know if my voice, if my voice is, uh, I mean, not by voice, but like, if, if, if this is not a call, then maybe Friday, maybe, maybe. That there's some songs that I, that I, that I want to sing that I remember recently because of Sunny's uh, birthday stream. And I really want to sing them because uh, it reminded me when I was uh, in a band with my friends and we sang a lot of those. <laughs> Very social. Uh, I wouldn't say that I'm the most social person out there to be honest. <laughs> Hello, Pian. <laughs> ah, your, your, your name in English sounds like Pian, like the emoji Pian, but in Spanish it sounds pretty bad. So I'm gonna say it in English because it's cute. <laughs> Pian. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I hope you stay for the future streams. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, the, I'm not the most social person out there, to be honest. Hello, Angel. <coughs> I'm, I'm actually not. The name Angel reminded me of a song that was in a, in a, in my brother's uh, plushie. He had like a giant. I don't remember if it was a bird. I think it was a dog. He had like a giant dog and he would sing uh what was the song the angel blah 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 what's that song do you guys know what that song is in spanish <laughs> in spanish it's 3 a.m. Go and sleep. What's that song? Ah, uh, what's that song? Was it from Sting? No, it was from Ah. Uh, uh, what was that song? I don't remember. Uh, I can't remember the song. Okay, we finished with this uh scene with this uh model so what we're gonna do is turn everything back on pew, pew, pew. I'm gonna save in in documents in um sketchup save not on title. This is stairs. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna close the window. Baby, let's go take a nap. Let's go take a nap. Let's go take a nappy. Back. Wait, I'm gonna blow my nose. <laughs> I swear, I have, I, I, I have like a very warm bra. I have a shirt. I have a hoodie, and I have a jacket, like a fluffy fleece jacket. 
I'm still so cold. No, I'm not like cold, cold. I'm just like sneezing. Salud, gracias. <laughs> Bless you, thank you. I like the idea of using 3D background for comics webtoon. I cannot draw for the life of me, but I picked up Blender, which is so cool. If you if you can use Blender, that's pretty cool. I don't know how to use Blender. For a moment, I was going to salud IRL. <laughs> Bring the sun to you. It's like 9 p.m. I cannot. Even if I won. No, don't waste money, gotcha. Control yourself. Your dad is gonna is gonna be pissed at you. I'm so hungry. Okay, we are done with this model, so I'm gonna check SketchUp because I don't know if the other models are actually organized. Um. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 being distracted by the song. I can't even like, I cannot even remember what the name of the song is. You're the angel. Was it? I I think it was called Angel Song. Aerosmith? Robbie Williams! Is it? Is it? Is it Robbie Williams or is Aerosmith? It's Robbie Williams! La 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 Where are the lyrics of this cute little song? Oh my god, can I find it for the guitar? No, I shouldn't play more guitar. But oh my god, can I find it for the guitar? Okay, the story is that... uh. Why I remember this plushy so much was that it was very easy to trigger the song. So sometimes the, the plushie would fall to the ground and it would start singing and playing the song. And it was like a jump scare. Robbie Williams. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Perpetual hunger state on stream. If Ayer was here, he would be like, Are you hungry again? Mm -mm. And I thought it all she offers me protection, a lot of blood and affection, whether I'm right or wrong. And uh, the waterfall. Where did it make take me? I know the life won't break me When I come to call She won't forsake me I'm loving angels instead Is there a Spanish version of this? Angels Robbie Williams Spanish Espanol Es Espa Es Espanol There's a Spanish version! Hmm. 
y te fallé, te hice daño, tantos años yo pasé por todo sin, sin pesar, también sin casi amar, al final quien me salva. ¿Eh? How is this? Ah, no, 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 wrong. Cuando estoy fatal ya no sé qué hacer Ni a dónde ir, me fijo en ti Hacia dónde estás, mi vida cambió El ángel que quiero yo That's the version, that's the version of the song Man Good memories I don't even know where that plush is anymore. Did they throw it away? Okay, what am I what 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 am I looking for? I wanted to compare two models. I wanted to compare the live haul of this model and the one from the one that I've used before. Mm -mm. You can sing. <laughs> sort of. Congrats on finding the song. I'm sure I've heard that in Spanish. Yeah, it exists. The one that I knew was the Spanish version. This one looks pretty good. But do they have like a... Scenario? Oh... Why is so much? Where's the light coming from? Can I turn off the lights? Help. 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 What? What I do? Oh, you guys are not seeing what I'm seeing. Wait. Let me close this. Can you please close? Can you close? Or I can just change it. I can... I can just change it. Uh, sketch up. This one. Okay. Do, what, what was I doing? I forgot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Camera. Previous. Uh, I don't know. Like, what the hell is all of this? I cannot read Korean. And everything is in Korean. Okay, I think the rooms... Ah! What was that? Oh my god. I'm PM from YouTube. Thank you so much for the follow. Was that a follow? Oh my god. <coughs> oh my god. My tiny little heart almost goes out of my body. Uh, uh, I wasn't looking at OBS, so I couldn't see. What happened? Did you guys not hear the notification? Did it not play for you guys? Uh, alerts. Yeah, it's monitor and output. Did you guys not hear? I heard it. Twitch alerts. Yeah, it's on. Was it a follow? I don't know. I couldn't see. I wasn't looking. Thank you for the probably follow. Ha. <laughs> uh. Yeah, haha. 
えへてへでなんだよやはえへ Where's the scenario? Oh, it's fucking untucked. Why so much fog? No fog. Okay. Okay. So what we gonna do is organize this model. Um. Actually, I'm um, gonna change to screen capture. Instead of window capture, application capture to SketchUp. I think you guys should be able to see uh, the the little windows now, right? I think you can. So what we're gonna do is organize this model because it's not organized at all. Um, uh, which is what I said at the beginning of the stream. Um, uh, I still don't know what the other names mean, but I'm just gonna create new categories. Uh, this is going to be called... Wait, let me move my iPad. So I can reach the keyboard a little bit more. Um, bathrooms. Bathrooms. And bathrooms are going to be blue. And then we're gonna use a tag function, tag tool. And we're gonna tag everything in the bathrooms. You know what? I'm gonna turn off this thing so it disappears. And I'm tagging it. What happened? Okay. Because we, we don't need the bathrooms. I already have a bathroom scene that is different from this one. Go away. Go away. Bye bye toilets. Bye bye trash cans. Goodbye. Okay. So now we tag the bathrooms. It just happened that it also the floor disappeared because this is the same layer. And then the next one is going to be stairs. Talking about bathroom, I kind of want to go to the bathroom. Eh, pretty color. Pretty color. It's like khaki. I'm gonna turn it off so we know that it's disappearing. Okay, the stairs are gone. And then... Uh, I don't know what that is, but we're gonna call it a prep room. I'm gonna change it to purple. Because I don't think we have purple yet. What happened? Why did the color not change? Yeah. Where? Okay. And then we turn it off. We hide it so we can just get rid of everything. Can I just select everything and make it disappear? Tag it all together. Can I do that? 
Yay! Okay. Okay, now that the things that we don't need are off. Uh, this part here. We are going to call it... Um, how do you call that? The mixer part. Uh, sound audio stuff. Sound uh, engineering. Sound check. Sound... Uh, sound mixing. I, I don't want to think about it. And, uh, ma, 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 what color would be nice? A guy has a nice minty color. Why did I change colors? Not Shrek color. I like a minty. Okay. Okay. And then we have the stage right here, right now. Stage, which is going to be this is like purple, like Barney purple. Maybe pink. 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 Okay, pink. Uh, I'm gonna tag it. Okay. Now we gotta figure out what the rest is. What is that? Oh, uh, this is like stage back. And then it's like stage mm, no live hall floor. <laughs> I think I wrote it right, I think. Um why is it the same color? That's a bit different, okay. And then we have... Uh, what is this? What is this? Eh? What is... Oh! Would be like a uh, south wall, sort of. South wall. And then we have um uh, right wall with the purple, the Barney purple. Barney es un dinosaurio que se come a la gente. Is that how the song goes? What is this? Eh? What is this? Oh, this is the stage lights. Stage lights. I'm gonna change it to yellow. I need so yellow. <clears throat> Look out the stars. Color shines for you. And everything that you do And it was all yellow And I think this is the ceiling Staring at the ceiling with you You don't ever say too much ba 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 and you ba 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 you weren't even listening yet. Oh yeah. Ceiling. Okay. I think um, everything is 
everything is pretty much um, well organized, at least the basics. I, I don't think I left anything untagged. So let's save this because I don't think that I deleted anything. So it should be all right to just save as the same uh, model. And then once saved, we are going here on Abler, Abler, however you say it. Uh, OBS. OBS, OBS, OBS. Uh, and then you go to File, Import, SKP from SketchUp model. And you, we, we look for uh, my SketchUp folder and then the one that is like something music or something live. Virtual to life. Da na 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 music full set. And then it was the live hall number three. <gasps> what did I do? What I do? Ah. What I do? Import. I pressed cancel. Okay, we're gonna wait. This takes a little bit to load. <clears throat> Barney is a dinosaurio vive en la selva. I, I don't I don't think those are the lyrics. To you, Linz, what's better to work with? SketchUp or Abler? Does one app do something better than the other? So I I like Abler because it's free and because it sort of has a nice uh rendering uh, function that you can edit how it looks while sketchup is like pretty basic so if you want more work is generally sketchup but in sketchup you can organize stuff you can uh, mum, mum, mum. can you hear this that's the sound of my glasses it's just scratching my nose bridge this sounds so ugly. What the heck? Um, 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 sketch, you have like more freedom of editing, but it's pretty basic. Uh, and in the web version, which is free, you cannot really edit much. So I would say that I would rather Abler, but I uh, still use SketchUp for the things that I said on this stream. So what you saw me do is uh, one of the reasons why I use SketchUp. The only bad thing that I don't like about Abler is that... Um, let me center the object. Okay. Did I keep the bathroom? Oh no, I didn't want to keep it. I want I want a new file. Delete. Can you can you go away? Why so many names in Korean? What the heck? What is happening? Okay, I'm gonna close the app. Don't save. I think I imported the wrong thing.
But it should, should be right. Did I save it? I think I saved it. Okay, I'm gonna save it again just in case. Somewhere else. On, um... Here. And then we're gonna call it Life Hope. What 3D file format is compatible with this software? Uh, I, I don't remember what the name of the file for Abler was. Um, but it can import several types of... So Abler is made specially for... Webcomic creators. But you can use it for illustrations and, and other stuff like that. It's like a more accessible version of Blender. To say it in a way. I'm in my way, 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 I'm in my way. What's wrong with me? <coughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> Ran out of tea. And then delete. So this is the things that you can import. FBX, SKP and Blender. Blend. In my case, I have SKP models. And then we go to documents. I go to... Wait. SketchUp. And then... Music. Music. Mm, music. Music. Banner music full set. And then the last one that I saved is Life Hall. And this one should be organized. I believe. I think. If I'm not mistaken. If the file will load. It's loading. It's loading. It's loading. It's loading. My ears, I'm sorry! Did it load? Oh, oh, okay. What is happening? I want a sinner. Okay, it's loading. This model is a little bit more heavy, so... Maybe I should go back to SketchUp and try to... Delete the rooms that I don't need. Okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go back to SketchUp. I'm gonna delete the rooms that I don't need because... Is a little bit too heavy for streaming right now. <laughs> it's probably okay out of stream, but for streaming, it's too heavy. And my computer cannot handle it. What do we not need? We don't need bathroom. We don't need... We don't need prep room. Uh, <laughs> and then, and then we don't uh, need the stairs. Uh, yeah, I think. Do we need the mixing? I don't think. I don't think we need it. Maybe we do. 
Yeah, we do. Let's just delete. Can I delete tag and delete the objects with the tag? Delete the entities. Okay. Let's save this as, uh, as, 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 oh, I just realized you guys couldn't see it. Let's save it as, um, light mode. Yes. Mm -mm. Blend, fantastic. Yeah, if you use <coughs> if you use Blender, it's pretty good. But if you have Blender, I don't know why would you use a blur if you know how to use Blender. I just use it because I I don't know how to use Blender. I tried, but it's just like it's just brainy is not brainy. I don't understand. Okay, okay so we. We gotta start a new file. File new. General. Eh. Don't save. What the hell is this dude saying? We're gonna select all. Delete. Delete. And then, uh. I wanna go to the bathroom. Yeah. 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 Import. Escape. Uh, then we go back to the freaking folder. Why did I just save it in documents? I'm so freaking dumb. But I remember this was like the last one. The last folder. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And then... And then like mode, import, and then loading. <laughs> Did I load? Did I load already? Then we select all and center. Oh no, it's still importing. <laughs> 64%, 66, 67, 68, 60, 70, 71. Uh, I'm tired. Tired! I hate backgrounds! I hate it! Okay, select all center, which is A and dot key. Please. Please do something. Hello. <laughs> is it is it too oh okay. I was like, why is it so big? It's still pretty laggy. <laughs> um I blow my nose. Annoying I'm mm -mm. not a pro at Blender yet. I can do modeling pretty well, but I still struggle with shading and sculpting. I just wanted to, to render, but I don't even know how to do that. In my little experience with Blender, it is not that difficult, but you have to have a good teacher. I'm sure you learn quick. Yeah, I would need a teacher. And with my social skills, uh, that's not, that's not happening. Um, 
Is this even Cinder on the screen? I don't... He was not. I'm sorry. I think it's Cinder now. Okay. Um, my, 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 my. It's just annoying because my phone is covering that side. See? No? And then I don't want the south wall with the mixing. And the... No, I do need the ceiling, I think. Staring at the ceiling with you. I should, I should stop. Load. Load. This may, may be a little bit too hard to do on the stream with my computer. Did I close the other things? Iggy. Iggy. Do I need the ceiling? Do we have the floor? The floor, 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 stage, life hall floor. Uh, I'm gonna turn off the ceiling just so it is easier to go to the side that I need. But I do need the ceiling. For this. No, no, no. What I do? This is a close up. Just the background. Ah! Right wall. Bye bye. Bye bye! Disappear, please. I beg you. Uh, okay. Hola, Alexito. <laughs> Alexito X D D D D D D D X D D D D D D D Alexito D D D D D. Oh, I forgot the X. Alexito X D D D D D. Hola. I can teach you the few things I know, but I, I cannot guarantee the results. What is happening? I would love to learn, but right now I just don't have the time. What I do? What did I do? Why? Uh, but I turn off. I hit the right wall. Wah! 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 It's a little bit hard to do on stream. Uh, why is the lights like this? Uh, 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 style. I turn it. Please, please be fast. Please be fast. Not so much, not so much. Go back! Go back! Go back! Not so much! Go back again! Guys, maybe this is a little bit too hard to do on the stream. I think this may be a little bit too hard to do in the stream. Why? Uh, uh, 180. Mm, minus 180. It's not showing. 300 Further What is this even? I swear 
I, 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 I found the one that I wanted, but ooh. This one is pretty good. What about 350? Three, 300. Three, three, fifty. Yes, really good. I like that. Mm -hmm. But why is the stage so dark? And only one light is turned on. The fuse. Why is it different though? The other one is also the fuse. <laughs> mm, maybe emission. Ooh. Uh, are the stage lights on? Stage lights. Stage. Stage lights. They seem to be on, but they don't show. Maybe a ceiling. Staring at the ceiling with view. Why is it so dark? Let's try adding lights. Light, light, light style. Lights. Area. Please work. Please work. Where is it? Where did it go? Where did it go? Oh crap. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna give up. I'm too hungry. I'm too hungry. I wanna eat. My stomach is rumbling. I'm brain is not braining. Eh, me, 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 life hope. Oh, it seems that it saves in Blend. Because this software uses Blender. Uses like the structure of Blender or something like that. But it's more uh, intuitive, easier to learn. For us non blender connoisseurs, uh, bye bye. I don't know how to read your name. <laughs> yeah, this is too hard to stream, so I'm just gonna call it a day. Uh, we've already been streaming like for two hours, so uh, I, sh I showed what I wanted to show. It's just that this background is a little bit too heavy for stream. Um, I'm gonna try to uh, stream tomorrow, if not the day after drawing, probably. And then maybe Friday we can do karaoke stream, maybe. If I feel like it and if I'm not too sick. <laughs> okay, okay guys, thank you for coming. Uh, thank you for hanging out and stuff. Have a good night. Evening, afternoon, wherever you are. Oh, maybe we can we can rate someone on YouTube. We can rate someone on YouTube that is currently live. <gasps> Sunny Brisco! Sunny Brisco is live. Do you think he needs do you do you think he needs uh, raiding permissions to raid. Um, 
customization add ready rig please sunny brisco sunny brisco uh i can raid alban where's sunny my man sunny my man uh, I need per I need rating permissions. Okay, we we are rating Alban instead. Okay, thank you guys for coming. Uh, uh, wait, I just arrived. Is the stream gonna end? Yeah, we're just ending. Uh, I'm gonna grab dinner. I'm too too uh too hungry. Okay, thank you guys for coming and hanging out and stuff. Uh, and uh, uh, we're gonna raid to Alba and, and don't forget to eat your meals and uh, I don't know. Bye <laughs> bye. Bye bye. Hasta lumbista. Is my ending string working? <laughs>